Welcome back to Callaway Park uh, for this football restart and what a game we've got for you here this afternoon. It's FA Vars second round proper between Helsin Athletic and Wessex League side Fairham Town. Watch and enjoy all the action on Pier and Films. While Helston haven't had any competitive action since the lockdown restart last week, their Wessex League opponents from Fairham Town have played twice, one of which was a comfortable 4-1 home win over Roman Glass St George in the FA Vars first round last Saturday. If you try and compare league form between the two sides today, well both have only lost the once. Fairham find themselves in fourth place after a midweek one-all draw, while Helston are in mid-table but need to play catch-up on some lost fixtures lately. Today, of course, with it being an FA Vaz tie, we will get a winner because if it's level at 90 minutes, penalties will follow, which Helston successfully came through in the previous round at St Blasey. From that last game at Blaze Park, we've seen a few changes. The Blues manager, Steve Massey, has brought in Owen Howe and Ryan Turner. And of course, they replace the departures of uh, Neil Slayford and Mark Goldsworthy. A win today for Helston will extend their unbeaten run in all football to nine games. For Ferrum, well, their unbeaten run is a little more impressive with it being 10 games since their last defeat. It all adds up to being an interesting encounter as Helston against Ferrum and brought to you by Ferrum Films. Now that's interesting. Ferrum have got a number 14 on them and I haven't got a clue who that is. Ball forward by uh, Kurt Robbins there. Ash Tattersall looks up to cross it, comes off uh, Dan Harrison, but forced nicely for Callum Benfield. Back to Tattersall again. Oh, Charlie Cooper, opportunity to shoot, he does, and he scores. So that ball crossed the uh, penalty area by Ash Tattersall. Fell nicely to Charlie Cooper, had time to look up and uh, hit a good, sh strong shot through a melee of players into that far corner of the Helston net. So after what well, just approaching six minutes, Helston nil, Fairham Town one. Cooper with a throw, it's a short one. Still in possession though, Kurt Robbins, but robbed by Jewell. Now the ball towards Turner. New signing to this week. Goes past keeper Kempson, not quite completely though. He's still got the ball, it goes for goal. And it's blocked by the keeper, but uh, Helston have the corner. So Billy Tucker with this corner. Crowded penalty area. Wind catches it. It was uh, Turner who got the last touch. And uh, Tom Settle, the Ferrum skipper, went to the ground. But, uh, no real pressure on the uh, Ferrum goal from, from that occasion. And, uh, Ethan Jones will get there first for Ferrum towards Callum Benfield, taking on Tinsley. Tinsley gets a touch to it, but it doesn't stop the attack. Kurt Robbins, little jaw, almost tried to chip it over Sam Borthwick. Kurt Robbins already got three goals in the Vaz. Tinsley, how on the ball. Tucker takes over. This is looking promising. There's uh, four Helston players in the box, but Tucker's run is stopped by George Davis. It on. Turner won't get there before Galloway. Back to Kempson. Kempson clears. Jewel just got a top of his head to that ball, but uh, it's fair and back in possession again. Cooper looks up, cross, but good header out by Harrison. Cooper again comes inside a by, squares it. And a well, good effort there by George Davis. He uh, he survived the challenge and then shot across the goal, but Fairham lit lively on the edge of the penalty area. Fairham supporters uh, vocal behind the goal mouth there. Settle takes his free kick. It's met by Jewel Harrison, hooks it away, but uh, and he's far as a red shirt. Jones's cross is blocked by Story. 
Boy with a free kick towards Turner. Good header by the new signing. Brokenshaw surely will make more of this. Oh, hesitated. Didn't get his effort on goal in. And Kempson able to dive on the ball. That was a good chance. Gone begging. So a good kick by Borthwick. Galloway can only head it to Ryan Turner. His run was stopped. Shot is blocked. Now broken shore. Little ball to Catron. Howard made the run across the box. And his shot is blocked by Kempson. But better stuff now from Helston. So Billy Tucker will take this corner. It's a short one to Catron. Turns and gets it in. Harrison on the ball. Oh, good effort. But uh, headed by Wilcox. And Turner has two attempts. The first one is blocked. And the second one is... Uh, Comes off the defender and over for a corner, but better pressure from the home side here now in this FA Vaz cut tie. Forward through Ash Tattersall. On to uh, Jack Breed, taking on Tinsley, but Tinsley was there to concede the corner though. In fine voice, the Fairham followers, all four of them. Tom Settle, the Ferrum skipper, is going to be quite tired after the game. He takes all the dead ball kicks, apart from the goal kicks, that is. Good corner, though. Borthwick wasn't able to get there first. It was, uh, I think it looks like Archie Wilcox heading in as he moved towards the ball, catching the Helston defenders out. Little flick on from the Tom Settle corner by the Ferrum number five, Archie Wilcox. And 13 minutes into the second half here and uh, have Ferrum done enough to win this tie now they lead 2-0 here at Helston and that ball hits Phil Catron but falls nicely over Tadassal oh, challenged by Broker Charles a bit keen on on Ethan Jones so what's the referee going to do with this one then Holly Broken shot. Ollie Brookenshaw sliding in. The uh, Ferrum management suggested it should be a red card. Very sporty of uh, Ollie to make sure the player's okay. Having a few words. And it is a red. Straight red from the referee. So Helston already two goals down. Their match got even harder now with Ollie Brookenshaw being shown. Straight red, 18 minutes into the second half. Trailing 2-0. If it could get any worse, I'm not so sure. He's looked dangerous all game. Charlie Cooper, the number two, starting the rot after six minutes. And slows the game down. Cross is hit. Or blocked by Jewell. And Boy gets the clearance in. How good flick on. Can Turner get away from Kempson? Kempson's come out. Turner. Oh, his effort is blocked by the number six, Ethan Jones. And then a good challenge by Galloway. Galloway's put in some timely tackles the whole game. Corner comes in. Kempson comes out. Falls for Catron. It hits. Yes, eventually it does. No, the flag is up. The flag is up. Not quite sure what's happening here. The referee is. He's got a yellow. Oh, what is happening? The referee is showing a yellow card, I think, to the number 10, Callum Benfield. We're still not sure whether the goal has been given, to be honest. We do know it's the yellow for Benfield. Come on, come on, come on, yeah, come on, come on. This is where we could do the VAR. Fair and break again. Slade. Past Jewel. Woods is in the box. Bartlett Scott's at the far post. Oh, and that was uh, just wide of the uh, upright.